and we're back to learning GIMP. Let me show you how you can use motion blur to create this speed effect with copy the original. Now go to help, you search, type in motion, you'll find the zoom motion blur, double click on it. Preview is checked and then you have these two plus signs right here. The first one is for the intensity, the blurring factor, and the second one is for the position. You can left click drag or you can adjust it via the sliders right here. So first two are for X and Y position and the last one is for the intensity. You don't want to go negative as it sucks in the photo, the image content. You want to go in the plus region to have this typical speed effect. In this case 0 0.1, something like this should be fine. Then right click on this layer, add layer mask, make it fully white. Click on add. We are on this layer mask and we'll use the paintbrush and paint in black over it. So make sure it's a foreground color. I use a brush that feathers out right here. Let me go down with the size and now left click, paint over it. If you've painted too much, you can bring parts back by flipping the colors. So just make it white up here and then play around with it until you've got the effect that you want. In my case, I'm happy with this one and that's already it. This is how you can use a motion blur in GIMP to create this speed effect. I hope this video was helpful, thank you for watching and I'll see you next time.